Hello everybody, welcome back. It's Mr. Pro Games or Pro Fur. This is going to be a very quick little thing. Uh, this is going to be the start to episode 32 of our Pixelmon Reborn Survival Server, uh, Pixelmon Reborn series, sorry. Uh, there's no audio at the moment, hey, but if I try to mess with the settings right now, it wouldn't turn on. My favorite Pokemon just spawned, alright? I was not... <laughs> I mean, I'm so happy, but dang! Dang! I, I, I'm, I'm master balling. I don't, I, yeah, nope, I, I'm not risking it. Literally, literally my favorite Pokemon. Not risking it. Master ball. Don't even care. I know I needed to make that a clip. Uh, no clue what that'll ever happen ever again, but now I've officially gotten both of the Night Spawns, meaning Cresselia and Darkrai. I've officially gotten them both done. Uh, I, uh, <laughs> as you can see, I did some stuff off camera, but I don't even care if you see that. <laughs> Let's get a look at him. Oh my goodness. Oh, sorry guys. Let me fix my brightness real fast. This should be a lot brighter. A lot, a lot, a lot brighter. I had it turned off for, uh, or turned down a little bit. Oh my goodness. Oh. <laughs> I'm so happy. Can I ride him? I wish, dude. Oh god, he looks sick. He looks so sick. He he is going on my main team, 110%. IV is one, 73%. Trash special attack. But please tell me he's sync, please. Oh, oh, for all that is holy. Yes, the only one I care about, and he synced. Good, 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 good. Oh man, I'm so happy with that. I am so happy with that. I can't. I can't. I. I mm. I'm so happy with that. I'm going. He, I'm. I'm going to be training him. This is going to happen. I'm so happy. That that legitimately just made my day 110 percent better. Right there, just because of that. I've been AFKing for so many Dark Rye Moons, or so new moons, you know, you yeah, really gotta talk about the cycle here. But, I mean, like, just there's so many just in that one spot, waiting for one to spawn, and the off chance of what, and you know what? It's a good day! In the past 24 hours, I've gotten a Rayquaza, I've gotten a Dark Rye, and I've gotten a Xerneas. So, I have no room to complain at the moment. So, uh... Yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and end the clip here. I hope you guys enjoy it. Sorry about the of there being no um no no audio at the moment besides you know me talking. Uh, I'll obviously work that out for when I actually do start recording the episode. But I knew I needed to throw that clip in there. Uh, <laughs> I'm so happy. We're gonna have a training episode coming up just because of that. We're gonna have a team training episode that's gonna be coming very 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 soon. Because once I have a competitive team, we're going to start crushing some people. But uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed and see you guys in an episode in just a sec. Hello everybody, welcome back. It's Mr. Pro Games, or Pro if you prefer, and welcome back. Oh, shit, I said that twice. <laughs> it's all good. Uh, recording this kind of close to immediately after the last episode, uh, where I left off in 30 when I just went shiny hunting for Beldum. This episode... I thought we could, uh, make a bit of an area. Make a bit of an area. So, what I've been thinking for a little while is that I wanted to make a, uh, I wanted to go for the Reggies. Which, if you don't know, is Reggie Ice, Reggie Steel, um, Reggie Rock, and then Reggie Gigas. In the games, you had to get the three Reggies, and then you can go for Reggie Gigas. Well, in, uh, in Pixamon, you can go for any of them that you want. But, I do need all of them if I want to complete the decks. The only one that I, honestly, if you were to ask me which one of the four I care about, it's Regigigas, and if I had to pick one of the three, then it would probably be Reggie Ice, actually, probably. Hmm. I don't know, I'm going to have to think about that one. Either way, uh, but we're, what I thought we could do is that in order for a, ex for a Reggie Rock to spawn, they only spawn in, uh, I'm trying, I'm trying to think right this second. Where exactly I want to do this? I guess I could do it right here. That's not a bad. That's not a terrible idea. They only spawn at a certain Y level. Is this? I don't even know if this is my claim. 
So it's like I'm, I'm hesitant to start one right here, but I mean, I, I guess it's not going to work against me. Guess it did work against me. Okay, then. If it snows, the blocks will just get covered back up again, so I'm not worried about it, but looks like another two blocks forward, so I do need to build it in the claim somewhat. Uh, let's go ahead and just dig straight down from... I guess the corner over here actually isn't a terrible spot. Eh, it'll be fine. Yeah, wait till we get down to something that's... Yep, wait till we get down to stone. I think I'm gonna double check real fast what Y level we need to be at. Give me just a second. I'll be gone for just a moment. You guys will still be able to hear my audio. You just won't be able to see my screen. Please don't do that. Give me just one second. So, I believe, is it Regirock or Registeel? I need to make sure. Oh, wait, it tells me there's spawn requirements right there. Yes. Uh, it's. Reggie Steel, actually, I was wrong. Uh, Reggie Rock spawns in mesas underground. Reggie Ice spawns in freezing, but you guys actually saw that during the Easter episode. And Reggie Rock spawns in mountainous, which is where I'm at during dusk and dawn. But why 50 or below? So we're probably going to make it at Y46, something like that. Actually, there's a there's another one that spawns over here as well. I think it's um, Deancy. Underground Y50. Oh, they're both Y50 actually. One's dusk and dawn, and one's morning. Interesting. That's interesting. Alrighty then. Um, I think that's good enough. Because I'm in the middle of my claim here, I think I'm good making some space. But uh, this episode, I thought we'd focus on making a room, and then we'd also go fight through all the gems. Because now I'm able to beat all eight gems, so we can go through and do our quest rolls as well. As you guys remember from last episode, I'm still filling up my orbita uh, orbostatic souls. The episode that I get that done will be the will be the episode that I spawn Zapdos. So I will also be knocking out some Pokemon this episode, but I don't know if I'll be knocking out enough to fill up the orb. <laughs> I knocked out a lot last episode. Okay, I got a lot of work done on that, but I don't know if it's enough for that. Let's see. I might record that content actually if you guys remember the content that Bless was talking about last episode I'm just thinking about it right now it's like depending on what it is like I might record it we'll see it depends what kind of content it is still haven't looked into it but I will probably next day or so It doesn't need to be a super massive room, but it needs to, or sorry, it doesn't need to be a super, uh, it doesn't need to be a super big room in the sense that it doesn't need to be super long, but it needs to be really tall because the Reggies are all very big, like as in like five or six blocks tall. So uh, I need to be very cautious of that or else they won't spawn.
this is gonna need the room's gonna definitely need to be bigger than this but I mean it's it's fine for a start you know hopefully all those items will be gone okay I don't know why I did that but, I, can, but uh, I mean the room doesn't need to be that big but it does need to be tall or, or I guess I'll dig down actually will be easier is as long as it's below Y50, both DNC and Reggie Steel will be able to spawn, so I'll, I'm, I'm probably just going to dig down. And make it at least a little bit easier on myself. Maybe dig down three or four layers to make sure it's tall enough. The crappy eye, I kind of need that light. Night vision is a godsend. Haha. Uh -huh. So four blocks deep, but I can still jump out. Got it. Neato. But as always, I hope y'all are having a fantastic day, fantastic night, whatever it may be, and enjoy the content. When I started off this episode, uh, I was catching. Uh, I think it was. I think it was Kyogre. I think it was Kyogre. I'm sorry. It's been a while since I pre-recorded the first part of this episode. So if I'm wrong, forgive me. But I'm pretty sure it was Kyogre. Oh, no, no, no! No, I'm wrong! I'm wrong, I'm wrong, I'm wrong. It was Dark Rye. It was Dark Rye. I am very wrong. Legitimately, how could I forget about my favorite Pokemon? I forgot about my favorite Pokemon. I'm gonna look right now, but yeah. Yep, yep, yep! It was Dark Rye. It was Dark Rye. I, uh, my boy. I got my boy. I was very happy about that. Very, very, very happy about that. Dreams came true when I got that, alright? So, uh, yeah. I, uh... I, I do want I do want to EV train Darkrai and I will definitely use Darkrai, but I actually still have an EV trained him. I might do that this episode after we finish the room if there's time for it. We'll see. Because it is a Darkrai episode, so I definitely need to honor the boy and help him out because it's a very good Darkrai. Yeah, let's see. Don't know if I'll go for any legendary spawns for this episode. I think we'll just kind of work your way through, get this room done. And go from there. Because we got the gems, we got this. Honestly, the room only takes a few minutes. That platform that I'm supposed the 6,000 block platform that I was supposed to make for Blast, like, holy crap. <laughs> it's gonna take me a minute. I might get a, I might outsource some help, not gonna lie. <laughs> I might get, I might get a, somebody to come help me. We'll see though. I actually have to get to that part first. Let's see. Um. Honestly, it might not be deep enough, even still. So I'm gonna go down the two more, and then it should be deep enough. And then we'll use this room as our uh, our Reggie Steel spawn, or Deancey spawn, because Deancey, if Red the Reggies can fit, the Reggies are some of the biggest legendaries, okay? Like, period, they just are. So I mean, if a Reggie can fit in this room, then Deancey definitely can. So I'm not I'm not worried about it. Because I got, uh, I think I have a Runt Reggie Gigas right now that I got from a crate a while back. I didn't actually spawn it, otherwise it would have been a video. Uh, or actually, even then, it would still be in the future at some point. But I don't have a Reggie Gigas video at any time in the future right now when I'm recording this. But, I mean, it's, even as a run, it's freaking huge. So it's just, you know, something to consider. Um. Alrighty. What is that sound? It's trippy. At least a little bit.
Alright, don't do that. I don't need it any further down than that. Like, that's tall enough. That's fine. Thankfully, I have efficiency. If I was wearing Thunderstone armor, actually, this would have been smarter because I would go so much faster. I probably should have done that, to be honest, but it's fine. Although, for this, uh, let's go ahead and just toss everything out into the corner here. Okay, that was very quick, but that's exactly what I wanted. Alright, so, got that, got that, got that. I'm not going to toss that. Put that right there, put that right there. Put that right there. Put that back up there. And fill this back in. That'll be fine. I don't need it to be terribly bright. I just want it to be bright enough to where uh, if I come down here. Perfect. I just want it to be bright enough to where if I come down here, I'll be able to actually see. And it won't be just be pitch black, even without my moonstone, uh, my moonstone pick. So let's go back home. If I turn around, it'll be that in the little corner there. But there's an easy solution. And I don't think you guys have actually seen me craft one of these before. So this is actually a good opportunity. Got two of those, uh, and then I just need one block. Made a little mining run. It's fine though. Uh, I should have made. Should have gotten the other iron first. To be honest. Got two elevators surrounding a piece of redstone. With iron, gives you an elevator and picks them on. So we got that. Okay, let's not do that. First off. First off, let's fix this hole. Oh, all right, first off, actually. <laughs> first off, let me go down here and place the elevator. So, I think that's one. And then back home again. Are you going to load? Okay, I was about to say, I mean, did the textures just break or did I break something? <laughs> and then we can fix this. And then I might place that there and then shift. There we are. Perfect. And if I do this. I got one to place, so I'll just do that right there. Fair enough. And if I got those right there. Tons of blocks, tons of blocks. I think I have enough emeralds. Ah, right, so I'm just thinking about something for later on. But uh yeah, alright then. Let's go ahead and go ahead and fight our let's go ahead and go let's go ahead and go ahead. Uh, let's go ahead and fight the gems. Because that's what's next on the agenda. Got our board darker right there. See, that was a very quick process, though. I mean, we were very easily able to go over there and do whatever we can. Alright. This is my new gym team that I've been using. And I wanted to make sure that it was 100% effective before I was, you know, went on a video and I was like, hey, this works. Um, don't I use, oh, I used a life orb on him. That's why I was like, where the heck, what did I use on the card? Okay, yeah, I used life orb. So choice band, choice band. Uh, I actually, this is a perfectly EV trained Xerneas. So if I do slash EVs five, Perfectly trained, high speed, high special attack. This Xerneas is going to wreck everything. I wanted to make sure that I got uh, the next one that I was using for uh, for gems like set up and ready to go. And this Xerneas is going to help us clear the dragon gym. He is going to be our our beast. To word it simply, all of our other EVs are kind of ruined on our Pokemon, so I wanted to make sure whichever one I got next was fixed. And it's his IVs aren't bad either. So if I do IVs five, I think he's eighty eight percent. 
Uh, this is a different one than the one that we caught in the other video, but it's uh, it's a better one. It's a better one. It's not an, it's, I wanted a timid one, but I, I wasn't able to get that, or sorry, a timid or a modest one, but I've been unable to get one, so. We're, I'm dealing with the Xerneas's that I have currently, which is a higher special defense, low defense, which isn't terrible. It's not great, but it's not terrible. So for the first gym, the normal gym. Whoop, and the fun begins. Got a Lucario. Here, give me just a second, you guys. Awesome. Sorry, guys. I, I gotta, I gotta do something real fast. Give me like 60 seconds, and we'll be back right on. Uh, get things going again. Uh, I apologize for the wait. I know this isn't very. I know this isn't very ideal for you guys, but uh, I'm trying to multitask a little bit. I hope you guys bear with me for a second. Gotta yeah. get something going. Awesome. There we are. Yes, Nidoran, I hear you. I promise I do. Let me go ahead and throw out some music. For those moments that I like I I know I like I've had a bad habit recently of just there'll be like a good two, three minutes of like silence just because I'm thinking or I'm talking or I'm paying attention to something, so I'll throw that's actually it's actually kinda cool. Alright. I dig it. They've done a lot of cool things to revamp this server over the course of the past like two months or so. So I mean, I, I'm, I've been enjoying my time on here for the series, and the series will be going on for quite a while longer for you guys. <laughs> There's still plenty of things for me to do on here. Like I, don't, I think it'll be quite a while before I'm able to beat the battle tower and do all that crazy stuff. But even with all the badges, like I, I'm not good enough to take on the battle tower right now. Just listening to the music a little bit. Neato. 
That was weird. Okay, game. Just gonna glitch me out a little bit. Which Pokemon? Oh, it's Gudra. That sucks, dude. What is wrong with him? That was stupid. It's like all his moves kept missing. Hey, dialogue is fight. Gotta respect my boys. Freaking Hydra was coming off at uh, Darkrai earlier. You don't come at my boy Darkrai. I should probably tell him that, to be honest. Ah, uh, well, you know, it's worth a shot. Oh, holy crap. Okay. Okay. I'm just... <laughs> you can't win. Nothing can win. Gudra's is Gudra Supreme. All that is is good for Supreme. Something was going on with Galaxy. Oh, Galaxy spawned at a sweet coon, that's what it was. I was trying to remember based on the people that were on the server. Worth a shot. Oof. Holy crap, how was that? Oh, he badly poisoned me. Yep.
Come on! If only I had a super effective move, this would have been over. Oof. This is wild! That's bull! What the fu- I've never lost to that- Okay, I'm a little peeved at that now, but okay. Whatever. Whatever. That's some BS. That's some absolute BS, but okay. Like I'm, I wanna wish I could flick him off. Some absolutely stupid. Mm -hmm. mm. Okay. Sitting there raising his attack over and over with frickin' swords dance and then frickin' protecting himself every other turn. <sighs> he got lucky. Oh well, doesn't matter. Can't win them all. Is Come on! Why is everybody avoiding? Come on! That's so annoying! So unbelievably annoying. Like, I'm not expecting to win every single battle, every single encounter, everything, because, you know, this team isn't exactly perfect, but it's very annoying when it's, like, very obvious things should happen, don't. Because uh, I've done these battles, like, dozens of times now. But, I mean, it is what it is. Hey, I, this is nostalgic for me, as far as gym themes are concerned. It's a morning, it is a morning spot. All right, well then I'll definitely be going for Tapu Coco. Also, I learned that I can go through basically this entire gym just with Salamance. I already did it. Once already. Like a, it's a stab move, but it also does great damage, so it's just like it knocks them all out. Awesome. 
One more to go! And we'll have gone through all eight for the day. The last one's a bit trickier though. And we're gonna have to be quick because I don't know if we're gonna have enough time between uh, battling this last gym and a morning spawn. Thank you guys for putting up with this, by the way. <laughs> with all of the various things going on, with me stepping off videos for a second, with everything. I might die. If I die, then I'm just gonna go to the spawn. I'm not gonna... Um, who's faster? <laughs> okay. That's wild. That's what that- that's what using a physical type move! That's so crazy. Alright, let's do slash home. We'll, we'll, we'll go to warp crates and we'll do that all in a second. But this will allow me to get my bearings, so to speak. Oh, that's jungle edge. We need to go to regular jungle, so let's go over here. Um, so we need to take that off him and that off him. Actually, I'll leave that on because we have, we have extras now, so I don't need to worry about it as much. It's like, I like, Lucario is basically always on my team. And everybody else just gets swapped out. Now, Dark Riot, we can start EV training him because I'm not gonna need Timid. Yeah, I'm not gonna need Timid for a little while. I have a. a box specifically for them. Right, where are we at time wise? Here, give me just a second. Go ahead. I need to eat again to regen the rest of my health. I just needed to set something up real fast. Um, we we want speed and we want that and then HP. So 252, 252, and then four. Or is it six? I think it's four. So we only want to use Dark Ride because if I do slash EVs three, yeah, he's still blank. 
He's great, though. I mean, he just needs to be capped for his... I thought I capped him. He is capped. He is capped. I know I capped him. Yeah, I capped him already. He's good. So, he, he's perfect speed, special defense, defense, special attack, and, a, and a, a, a HP. So, his only thing that's low is his attack. So, he's perfectly fine. He's good. So, I, for that, I just need to knock out magic cards. He thought I was throwing off, but I was just trying to check and make sure he was trained. Come on, Tapu Koko! Uh, Why did I try using Earthquake against the Zubat? That was stupid. If a Tapu Koko spawns, I will be hype, not gonna lie. Please! Please! I need Coco! I need Tapu Koko! I need Tapu Koko! Please! Game Corner, come on! Oh, I'm so excited! Come on! Dang it. It's D&D though, so we'll be back, we'll be back. Siri, set a timer for 16 minutes. Sorry, I know, I, my phone's right under my mic, so sorry about that, guys. But uh, that way I don't need to pay attention to it, and I can be back. And not that I can't look up at the top right-hand corner of my screen, but you know what, it's better to have a reminder in case I get distracted. Because it only takes me a second to teleport back. Anyway, let's go back to crates. Anyway, let me actually go to my game settings real fast. Did that not... That would help a little bit, but it seems like it's still relatively loud. Alright. So I just thought it was a little loud. Not not very loud, but a little loud. So I wanted to turn it down a little bit. Um Between spawns we'll train up our dark ray, and then after our dark ray is trained up, we'll end things off. Yes! No! No! I need the bells! I haven't gotten a single bell since I joined the server. Give me a title bell, please. I need it. I know you can see it. It's the blue one. You were so close. You were the chosen one. Ah. A destiny knot. I have so many of you. I know they're worth like 200k a piece, but I don't need it. Uh Come on! No! No, no, it's not gonna be it! It's all about where the rotation starts. You can already tell right where it's about to end. I don't need berries. I'd never need berries. A master ball or bells, that's all. Ah. Uh, sad day. I know, I just want- <laughs> Ah, it's so bad. How long has the episode gone on? I should probably check that. No, shouldn't I? Forty-one minutes. Uh, Forty-one minutes actually isn't that bad. I can't. I can't. I can't say that's bad. That's not bad compared to. That's not bad at all. Um, in comparison to how long some episodes have been before. Not that I'm saying long episodes are necessarily a bad thing. I just know for viewers, you may not want it to drag out. You may like and want longer Pixelmon episodes, but 
based on my analytics, the answer to that is definitely a no. Um, four Dynamax candies now. Neat. Once I get ten, I can perfectly Dynamax something. I might do that to my shiny Arceus, to be honest. Perfectly to combat anything, just a shiny Arceus. Alright, time to go to home... Kingdom... There, there should be magic carp spawning beneath us. Got it. And then now we can just use our Darkrai. Does our Darkrai have any decent moves that can knock it out? It has Dark Pulse. Alright, we'll roll with that. Feels weird throwing out a Master Ball, not gonna lie. At least it's in a very quick to respond to slot. Of course, you know, there's just no other Magikarps. Alright, we'll even come back. And while we're waiting a second... We need magic carps. I actually got it, dang. That was just on a whim, but I actually got it. Normally you don't want magic carp to spawn because of how common they are, but when it comes to speed IVs, you really do want them to spawn. Come on. I think that does it, honestly. Now if I do slash EVs 3, yep, I already got 81 speed EVs. We're already 21% or 20, almost 20% done. Thankfully, special attack EVs and speed EVs are kind of the easiest ones. And uh, the ghastly line is the best for special attack. to get all of them before the clear happened. Good. Alright, now we can clear some more. That was my goal. That's why I was concentrating for a second. I was like, I need to make it all of these. I need to make it all of these. I need to make it all of these. Because it's going to speed it up. It's good to speed up the process. Good to get on a grind, you know? Alright. Uh, thank you. Um, That's not too bad. 
Got a Trimeco just chilling down there on the seafloor. Just all by myself. Just playing in the background. <laughs> Go Darkrai! If I saw somebody battling a Magikarp with a Darkrai and like, if I, if I was in the Pokemon world and I saw that, I would honestly be like, what did it do to you? <laughs> Walking for it. Speed is done! Just like that! That's awesome. All of those magic cards did it very, very quickly and very, very easy. Actually, let's get our, uh... No, 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 let's come back, because otherwise it's gonna end up being something else. So, in order to get the special attack EVs, we gotta go over to the Ghost Tower. How much time we got left in our timer? We got seven minutes. We got a bit of time. Ghost gym. There's one at the poison gym and one at the ghost gym, but either way it works. Just make it easy. We're looking for the ghastly line. I don't know if the other ghost types do it, but I know that the ghastly line does, so that's what we'll be going for. Hey, I will welcome all Gen 4 music. Da, 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 da. Gen 4 and Gen 5 probably have my favorite soundtracks. Probably. It'd be, it'd be a very... I, I like, okay, I like some of the stuff from Kanto and Jutsu, like Red and Blue, like, obviously I like those soundtracks as well. It's just because they hit home. I probably poured more- the two games I've probably po poured the most time in in my lifetime for Pokemon is probably... Platinum and Sun and Moon. Easily. I think I already got that, yeah. I'll have to come back here because, I mean... Speaking of Furret, because there was a Walking Furret song that we played a little bit ago. We're just gonna take a step away so the spawns change. How much time is left? Five minutes? Wow. Almost no time at all has gone by. Neat. Really do need there to be some more haunters over here though. I tried running far enough away to where different stuff spawned, but I was about to say maybe it didn't work, but it worked. Ghost towers are very convenient. Might go to the one in the poison biome, the or by the poison gem next, to be honest. Because I don't know if I like this one as much. I just came over here because, you know, ghost gem. It's also Gengar sometimes up here. I thought I can get I thought I could snipe him as I was falling. Okay, obviously he has a, an arc that I wasn't more paying attention to, that's fine. Alright, let's walk around the side here, see if any spawned on the outside. Just totally parkour that. And jumped into that, that's a shame. You want to let me fall? Thank you. We got the Zigzagoon. Alright. We're gonna go back to... We're gonna go to Home Jungle. Just because I know we still have like five... We have a few minutes left. Like four, between four and five minutes left. Oh, we still have a, well, I, I honestly, the easiest way to check is going to be that four minutes. Oh my goodness. One type of cocoa spawn. Give me an adamant type of cocoa and I'll be good. Oh. I guess while we wait, 
instead of working on dark ride we can just knock stuff out because i don't want to be away whenever that happens and i wasn't going to try and wait for all those pokemon to respawn we're just about done though uh evs three we've already got 100 special attack ivs so uh we're actually making pretty good progress 69 percent done already and we haven't even been doing it that long yeah for about not even 15 minutes guys so it'll be done fairly quickly it's just you know a little bit of patience here and there What just leveled up is the question. <laughs> These Arceus can't level up, so I don't know what the XP thing. Oh, I'm getting XP from knocking stuff out, so I'm I reach level 50. Neat. Cool, cool, cool. I actually didn't realize that, if I'm being completely honest. I, th I knew you got XP from trainer battles and stuff. I just didn't think you got XP from normal Pokemon battles, but this is kind of a derp thing on my part. I mean, I probably noticed before and just forgot, but I mean, it's... XP isn't necessarily isn't really valid in Pixamon, or not nearly as valid as it was. It's just a convenient thing to have. But once you have everything you need it for, it's kind of just there. I wonder if my night vision is going to be over by the time before. Uh, that's only for 15 more seconds. You know what's convenient? I was prepared for such a moment that I might have to farm spawns. So I built this in just in case. And our orb is definitely getting there. Ooh, hello there. Oh, you're only level 53. I wonder if knocking out your Pokemon counts, or if it has to be wild. That'll work. That'll work. Neat. The golden Arceus, dude. I, I I love the Arceus. I know you guys haven't seen that episode yet, and you're not going to see that episode for a little bit. But it, it's it was such a glorious thing, and I, I knew immediately after I had him, since I knew he could fly, I was like, he needs to be my flyer. Even if it's a bit of a spoiler for down the line, I mean, I, there was a lot of suffering that I had to go into getting this Arceus, so. I highly recommend you watch the content that I that I got him because it, it was it was grueling. I did get him myself. No, I did not have help. It was I had some spectators, but I I, uh, I would not want to relive it. Let's just say that it it was a great outcome, but it was a painful road. Very very painful. It was a two episode road actually, so those will be coming up at some point. I think we wanna... I wasn't paying attention. I wasn't paying attention or else it could have been on me! No! I wasn't paying attention! Ah! Question mark? <laughs> Galaxy has a bad habit of... Galaxy has a bad habit of not saying a word when they get a legendary. I think so. I think it's Galaxy. Because they've, they've gotten one on themselves before. I've seen one spawn on him before, so I know he doesn't need the Lele. It's just a matter of whether or not he wants to give it to anybody. 
He already has a Lele, and he still had extra spawn on him, and he just kills him. I've been trying for the tapis. Had I been on the ground, that could have been on me, but you know what? It's all good. What's the new timer, actually? I should be checking that. 15 minutes. So it'll be a night spawn. Alright. Tapu Koko. That's all I want. I don't. I need the other Tapus to Dex, but I only care about Tapu Koko. I don't care about any of the other ones. Um, Alright, let's get a little quick. I'm very sad. Had I not jumped up on the elevator when I did, that could have been me. Ah, it's whatever. It's fine. It's fine. Stuff happens. Hardly the worst thing. You guys have no idea. Some of the legendary encounters that I have off camera, like I had a Deoxys that teleported away from me underground or went somewhere. Basically, I was actually, no, I was on a platform in the sky, so it teleported out of existence. Uh, then I had a Yuxi that killed itself with Memento. So, I mean, it, it's, there, I've, I've dealt with some rough situations. And, of course, probably the most painful for every player is going into a, a Meltan encounter and getting a Ditto. So, I mean, it's, uh, it can be rough. It could be rough. Um. Okay. Sure. 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 I hear a haunter. I just don't know where it is. Alright, got another haunter right here. Good, good, good. I'll take I need all the haunters. A floating Bidoof. He's just taken upon the powers of God. Obviously, I know he's just on the lily pad, but... The man's just chilling. Make one lap through here. Alright, let's go ahead and uh, head over to the ghost gym again. For some reason I thought that one of the poison gym was better, but it's not. It's really not. But, uh, it's fine. Let's go ahead and run over here. Man, the games just want, I mean, we have great connection right now, but the game still wanted to lag on us just a, just a wee bit. Just a wee bit. There we are. And that's why I checked the outer rim. We are going to get this boy done. Within a reasonable time frame. That's a tiny Miss Magius. 
Yes, my brother really likes Chandelure, but I mean, I I think Chandelure is a neat Pokemon, but it's it's uh, mm. it would not be my favorite from Gen Five, any way, shape, or form. I think I saw a Gengar up there. If I'm not mistaken. I think yeah, that's a Gengar. I was like, I'm not sure, but I think that's a Gengar. Yep, sure enough, it is a Gengar. I knew they spawned around here. It's just rarer. Uh, oh, I'll check the EVs. Oh no! We're so close. We're so close. We're so close to being done. We're so close to being done. Legitimately, just like one to two more Haunters, Ghastlies, or a Gengar, and we're done. And like that's that's that. So we're stupid close, but we're not quite there yet. I'm walking away for a second so that uh, can I ride on? Can I ride on Darkrai? I wish I could. You're you're an absolute beast. And if you were Pokemon were real, I'd make Darkrai my best friend. It would just need to happen. Darkrai is my favorite legendary. He he can give me nightmares. I'd still be his friend. Throat spray. I need to know what. That does not sound right. <laughs> it doesn't sound right. <laughs> That doesn't sound. I'm sorry. I know I've said that a few times, but that doesn't sound right. I just got throat sprayed. No, 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 no. That should not. That should never be an item in any kid's game, ever. It just sounds wrong. <laughs> but all right then. Sure, sure, Game Freak. Even though this is the Pixelmon mod, it's still based around Pokemon, so I'm sure there was an item called that. I, I just have no clue what its purpose would be. I don't even know where to where to look, to be honest. Got a Meowth right here, though. I mean, might as well. Just because we uh, also have the opportunity to try for um, emulet coins. Let's go back to warp crates, though. Why are you the way that you are, dude? Why are you the way that you are? Who hurt you? <laughs> I have six weekends named after water brands. Now that is worthwhile. I will I will absolutely positively support that. That is beautiful. But just Catching Suicunes to catch them, they all—they just need to be, you know, get them to kneel down and just shoot them in the head. That—that's all. That's all I can say about that. Wow, I'm gonna need to wait for that. Uh. For the clear, because I mean, there's there's no hoppers, like no hop, no like none of the ghastly forms. Which oh, there we are. I was like, there's like nothing. I was like, holy crap, you know, there's just nothing around. But uh, got one. Guess something's better than nothing, but it's just like okay then. EVs three, and we're done. Thank goodness. So now we just need to do the. Uh, We go here and then put on power weight. Normally there's so many Clefairies, but I, I just need one Clefairy. It's like the only time I'll ever be looking for one. 
is when I'm ever using a power weight or something. I may need to come back. <laughs> uh, I'll use a traditional PC instead of the command. I think it's K L M M. Sorry about this, guys. It's it's a specific button on the keyboard that basically toggles your Pokemon. Oh, it's O. Oh. I was just I always forget what it is, and I end up just spamming keys. Let me make sure I'm still recording. I am good. I was like, uh, did that just mess up my recording? But no, I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Neat. All right. Um, we just need one Clefairy. Thankfully, I've been chilling here, so that spawn should be normal now. So I should check spawns. Legendary. Three minutes. And it's done! Max HP, special attack speed. Now slash home jungle. And not time to wait. But we are done training. Our Darkrai, it is done. The deed is done. We are good. Probably the goal of next episode will be to finish up our... Um... Oh, let's not do that. But the goal of next episode will be to work on a different legendary. Let's do that. That. I think that's the right one, but I'll give myself both just in case. In the case of Lele spawns, I need my modest to be up because Lele is a special attacker. So, best to be prepared. Probably one minute. Yep. Get the Lele odds up there. Oh my goodness. This Dark Rai is absolutely maxed up. 405 special attack, 349 speed. Ah, that's 10 more speed than my maxed out Arceus. Think about that. Uh, and obviously his other stats are probably going to be definitely be mediocre in comparison to RCS. Like we got 381 to 282 and 372 to actually no 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 Darkrai has better is definitely has better uh, boost to his attack stat. But uh, defensively RCS is still better, far better, and its HP is better as well. So I mean, I guess you could say RCS is more well rounded, but Darkrai is more of a glass cannon. This boy's gonna come at you. <laughs> oh my goodness. Hmm. Let me go ahead and put him right here. BC's done. I need to work on Ryalu and Groudon as well. Groudon I actually can work on. 
that'll be something coming up. I believe the episode where I got the shot that's 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 coming up. Um, I'll probably wait until that epi I'm working on that episode in order for me to EV train those guys because that could be something I save for that. But Let's put the timid one back there. It's definitely a fail. There's no way. Yep, 18 minutes. So back to a night spawn, and then I think we're good. I think we're good for this episode. So because we uh, we made our little underground area for Reggie Rock, or sorry, not Reggie Rock, Reggie Steel. We worked in our dark rye, and we went against all the gems and used all of our keys. So you know what? I think that's a very productive episode. As always, I hope you guys have enjoyed. I hope you guys enjoyed the dark rye catch in the beginning. I hope you guys enjoyed us training the man up. He will be part of our. He's definitely part of our dark gym team. Um, so as you guys saw me put him in a slot there next to Guzzlord. But uh, yeah, as we continue to work on the team, as we continue to get stuff together, it'll all fall, all the pieces will fall together. Um, but thank you guys for bearing with me. I hope you guys all have a fantastic day, fantastic evening, whatever it may be. And I'll see you guys all in the next one. Take it easy, guys. Bye, guys.